Turkey symbolizes a lot of the conflicts we see around the world. There's a kind of dynamism, there's an unsettled kind of change going on. There's just so much richness of, of culture, of ideas, of conflict that I've, I've never seen or understood elsewhere. It was an incredible time to be in Turkey. It coincided with the protests that were happening in, in, in Taksim Square in Istanbul. We didn't expect the Occupy movement to happen. Um, it started literally the day after we started the program. By the fourth day, the city was uh, looked completely different than what it did. It was sort of challenging to be in the protest mindset all the time, but it was even stranger to go through different mindsets on our way to work. And it was clear that the politics changed as we moved through the city. In uh, Istanbul specifically, International Field Program uh, is focused on transition to democracy. So students work with organizations that deal with human rights issues, with uh, freedom of speech, freedom of assembly. So I work for this organization called Muslim Dirt. They're a Muslim human rights organization, so they deal with a lot of really religious rights. What I found was most interesting was the, the kinds of solidarity actions that this organization had. Even though they were sort of traditional and conservative in their focus, they found most successful solidarity with the Kurdish uh, human rights activists and also women's human rights activists if their activism aligned. They also worked on issues associated with human rights uh, abuses or at least human rights issues in the protests and though they focused more on asking uh, the protesters and uh, participants about police violence. They were interacting with ur urban space uh, a lot and so a lot of the, I'm sure a lot of the issues that came up even in protests had to do with the very urban aspect of that uh, uprising such as the fact that it was about a park, it was about a public space in a big city that has increasingly less and less public spaces. Muslim Dur supported the protesters' concerns but some of the protesters disagreed with you know, like the state pushing Islamist policies. So uh, our organization was sort of at odds with some of the claims that the protesters had. It was a very important learning environment. I think uh, we really benefited, and maybe this is a bad thing to say, from the fact that it was happening uh, because it allowed us to talk about things we couldn't have talked about or perhaps not quite in such a nuanced, detailed, very direct way, that they had this uh, phenomena taking place in, in front of them that they can in, engage with to some extent and understand the politics. Uh, the economics, the social, cultural context, uh, by far better than any book or even any lecture could deliver. I really enjoyed what the protest allowed for a bunch of foreigners that we were, that all of the IFP students were, um, that really gave us perspective into some of the fault lines within Turkish society. The examples that you, you see in Turkey of conflict um, symbolize conflicts around the world. So I think that I just, I learned a lot about life as well as Turkey and Istanbul that I wouldn't have learned elsewhere.